Yeah, it was definitely a tense situation. A lot of people asking questions and him saying normally he wouldn't hold a press conference on something like this, especially while they're investigating. But given the earlier press conference, he felt like he had to say something. As you mentioned to Emily, he brought up the misuse of funds, the allegation of that. And he said they are fo focusing on child sex abuse. And so any funds that go towards preventing child sex abuse and investigating cases like this is money well spent. Now, the uh, the attorney did mention uh, asking him to resign. So we did ask the sheriff, Sheriff Smith, if he considered resigning. Here's what he said. So with that said, for what it's worth, um, neither I will not be resigning. So as you saw right there, he said he will not be resigning. He also mentioned the public information officer will not be resigning. He also pointed out that Levitt mentioned himself in the case and that he has not mentioned Levitt at all during this investigation and they have not released any information regarding that investigation. We did ask if Levitt is a part of the investigation. He would not confirm that. There were also questions about how long this investigation has been going on. He said victims came forward about a year ago and reporters asked if it was properly investigated. His response was portions of it were properly investigated, but as a whole, that's still under question. Reporting live in Utah County, Courtney Johns, ABC4 News.